All right, folks, we are back. We are going to do the instructional video on how to operate this safe arm safe. Um, these instructions apply to this safe and this safe only. They may translate to other safes, but I don't know. Um, first, we're gonna unlock and unload the safe. If it is your first time operating your safe, it will be empty. Um, if it's the first time operating uh, this safe for you as well, the uh, fingerprint reader will operate with anybody's fingerprint until it is set. Um, also, one, two, three, four will open the safe as well as the key. Um, you'll have to open it with a key the first time because there's unlikely a battery in it. Mine did not come with one. Um, first step to uh, operating your safe will be to install a battery. It is a simple nine volt system. You will pull the foam. Pull this bag, which conveniently I have no idea what it's for, but I'm keeping the instructions in it. Um, <laughs> you could keep jewelry in it or other things that might get lo loose, lost, uh, etc. Uh, cash coins, um, any valuables that you might want to sneak into the gun safe below the firearms. But anyway, it comes with this uh, Phillips head screwdriver. You remove uh, your battery door, um, and you should be familiar with a nine volt battery. It is the uh, little rectangular style um, with two posts. They last a long time. I keep a spare in my safe. All right, next step. You're going to press this red button right there. All right, to set the uh, fingerprint uh, reader, you're gonna press the red reset button. Do not hold it. A beep twice. All right, let's see if I can add another fingerprint. So we'll press and release the button. So I think I've added that fingerprint. So that fingerprint, that's the middle finger. Pointer finger has been added. Middle finger's been added. This is my ring finger. We'll allow it. Press the button again. Well, maybe I should do a. Right. Now it's approved. Ring finger. So now my ring finger will operate it. Middle finger will operate it. Um, as a better demonstration, I can do ring finger with the safe closed. All right, so that's all set. All right, so once you've set your fingerprint code, I would move on to the uh, keypad code. Um, yours is going to be default at one, two, three, four when you get it. Um, all right, to set your passcode on the keypad, you're going to press and hold the one button for two seconds till the gun safe beats twice and the green light will turn on. You're gonna enter the previous passcode. Um, apparently resetting the fingerprint actually reset my passcode, which is super irritating. So you're gonna to wanna to check that um, if you're not using the passcode frequently. Um, yeah, so I had mine set and after resetting this, it uh, changed. So you're gonna hold the one, two seconds until the use twice, green light comes on, enter the existing passcode. Now you can enter a new passcode. So now the password has been set at 23411. <laughs> All right, that's a wrap on today's video. Um, I hope you liked what you saw. If you did, please hit the like and subscribe button. Um, most of our videos aren't how to's or reviews, uh, but in this case, this uh, safe was new to me and I thought other people might uh, appreciate a review video on it and a how to video on it. So you can go check out the how uh, review if uh, interested and um, hopefully this how-to is helpful.